As far as how I knew I wanted to be an educator, I think I felt it pretty strongly in high school. And I think that's where a lot of people feel like, oh, I think I might want to do this as a career. Um, I'm a clarinet player, and I had an amazing high school band director. And that's not an unfamiliar story to many. And that person inspired me to take private lessons, to pursue different avenues outside of um, our own band program. I started playing in a youth orchestra. I auditioned for Allstate and, you know, all the things that happen with kind of eager and, and aspiring young musicians in high school. And I think at that time um, in our program there, uh, we had a lot of opportunities for leadership, especially within the marching band. And I loved that. You know, I loved being a student leader and a section leader. And through that process and just kind of being on the other side of the fence in really small capacities, I enjoyed the art of teaching and taking my passion and love for music and trying to see if I can't help other young musicians get better. So that was really the seminal experience and the seminal, I think, um, I guess, opportunity that I had. And that really got me thinking, maybe I might want to do this as a career. And so then, after I took lessons and got more involved in the music community where I was at, I then thought, well, you know, college is, maybe this is something I should try to pursue. And so I went to a couple of different places, applied to a few different places, and got into the ones I wanted to get into. And Minnesota was right at the top of my list, the university, in fact, where I'm teaching now. And from there, I just, I just kind of followed my passions as a performer and an educator. And I wasn't really sure where that would lead me. Um, I thought it would be great to teach high school, but I also thought teaching elementary might be interesting or middle school. And band, because I was an instrumentalist, I think was sort of the natural, the natural instinct to want to get better at that and find some kind of a career in that. But every step of the way, I didn't have a, you know, this must be my job or I'm going to be X. I just thought, you know what, I want to play my clarinet the best I can and, and teach music to whoever is willing to be taught and see what I can do in the, in the industry. And that's really how it started.